Walking through Katara, the cultural hub of Doha, Qatar, on my last day, I was reflecting on this unusual and unique festival of football. Has it all been about money, goals, political gain? Or have some shared and received something more fundamental to human experience? This World Cup, like no other, had another surprise for me. A chance to virtually visit the start of the mission of Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him. A VR experience being given to non-Muslim fans. Once a city packed with idols where infant girls were buried. Slavery and inequality were widespread. But it would all change. In the night of the first revelation, Jibreel would carry the words of God to our beloved prophet, Igad Hiram. Islam will come to correct the ills of our society and become a mercy, a journey through time. Uh, so, um, it, it would, yeah, it was like being there, and you felt that you were in the cave of Hira. <laughs> it's a tough one. It's really beautiful, mashallah, well done, guys. How do you feel after? I don't know, I just feel a bit overwhelmed, honestly, overwhelmed. Just, you know, you just want to be with the Prophet, that's all. You just yeah. want to stand with him, and, you know, and you're grateful. Grateful for being Muslim, and grateful for knowing these truths. Alhamdulillah, shukrallah. The impact of the Adhan on World Cup travellers was plain to see all around me in Doha. Fans were mostly from South America that I met. Why? Because Europeans have been denied this beautiful experience by biased media reporting over more than a decade. The most controversial World Cup in history, and a ball hasn't even been kicked. Qatari society and cultures based heavily on a strict interpretation of Islamic law. However, I have been told by sources that some 1,000 people have taken shahada in Doha, and the number may be much higher. They've been embracing not just the family atmosphere of an alcohol-free event, but the time the peace and the safety to look into the meaning of life. And then, of course, well, there's Morocco. Penalty was the best feeling in my whole life. Tell all this, uh, not Muslims. Join us, join us. Join, join us. the Islam, join the Islam. Come to Wallahi. the good side, come to the good side. Come. Come to the peace, come to the win. Qatar 2022 felt like a virtual reality trip where the Muslims, well, we waged beauty on our visitors. We have to now continue this work, sharing the truth about our way of life. Till next time, Assalamu Alaikum.